Onivia. League of Legends highlights. Powered by ArcaneBet.com. Bet live on eSports. Answer, this was what they played against Faker. Yeah. With the, against Gallia. So they have shown this answer before. It is 7.11, so he hasn't been further tweaked. So he's still really powerful. Close, waiting in the brush. He is isolated. And Spirit in a lot of trouble, looking for a place to flash to. He's gonna buddy slam first, but in comes BDD first blood to Cuz on the Kha'Zix. Spirit getting caught out. Locked down with another grasp. Well, that thought, we got some action finally down in bottom. The, the charge on in from Tushin. Prey getting extremely low. The flash in. Tushin will get the kill there. But a teleport in from Longju and a free cut. They're going in 3v4. Not sure if this is going to work. Finally, we got this coming in. Kuro from the left side looking to burn down Cuz, and he will for those Malekic Visions. And now this is totally turning in Afrika's favor. BDD looking to taunt away. He dive this. Spirit tanking that turret. He's going to be taunted too. And he is forced to even just jump out of there. Now this is really messy. It looks like actually Tushin did go down. Okay, they bossed that like crazy. From Afrika following them. So they pick up a couple of kills and then Afrika botches the dive. Meanwhile in live, cuz you were talking about him going to this top side. Okay, here we go. Big dive coming in. Heroic entrance for the big knock of three members get put down, but it does not matter. Prey. Now Kuro tanking that turret. They do take it out and run away. Gonna take the one for one and the turret. And it's pretty cool. Okay, the flash on in. And oh boy, Kuro, you're not in the right position. Big engage by Gorilla is gonna take him out easily. And now Afrika all split up and on the run. Here comes Cuz with that red buff, the never endings. Uh, slows there. Tushin looks like he's going to sacrifice his life for the life of Spirit, but that's two kills going over to Longju. And Cleans does not. On the right side, does have his smite, but no flash. Look going to come in. Gorilla's trying to block it. Will they get the steal? Oh, no, they will not. A little bit early with Spirit. They will jump onto him after getting that power, and the chase continues. Kramer on the run. Gorilla from the right side. Kramer trying to be the hero. Doesn't look like he can, although Marwan will get Get out alive. Kramer will get taken out. Well played. Okay. Oh, more. Looking to get a bit frisky. They do get one to kind of caught between a rock and a hard place. Here comes Marin from the left side. Big taunt though onto three members. Spirit extremely low. The rest of Afrika on the run. Heroic entrance gonna keep Prey safe. Trying to do that damage onto the front line. You can see that Alistair's getting pretty low. Or actually, that was the Mordekaiser. That's going to be the kill. Onto Tushin, though. Kramer in the back line, trying to just kite them as much as possible. Marin still in the thick of things, <laughs> trying to go 1v5 on Renekton. They do get a kill, and Marin is still alive. The big root, Kramer, is still here. Kuro coming in, but he will oh. make it with his life with a double kill from the Valzahar. The Baron's an over. They've lost the Baron right away. And a TP coming in. Here comes Gorilla charging with those Moby Boots, trying to make something of it. Marin with a stun on the Cuz will deny any Baron steal. Heroic entrance. And he will zone out a bunch of members, though. Marin still going 1v4. And he is going to survive. Now BDD all alone is going to be locked up. So, so tanky. And he doesn't go down in spirit. Going a little bit too deep. Not quite as tanky as the Renekton. But Khan with a flash, and Kuro with a flash forward might meet his destiny. And down he goes. Lots of members are extremely low. <laughs> Kramer on the left, trying to kite once again. Marin and Kramer, it's the dream team, running away. Here comes that slow from Cuz. And Kramer still kiting them so, so well. The taunt is up, and finally they get that kill. The trade one for one. <laughs> are you kidding me? And there's me? the ace. Are you kidding? The big knock up. Can he get it? Big taunt there on Tatushin and Spirit, though. Tatushin extremely low with the follow-up knock-up. There's going to be Gorilla locked down in the heroic entrance. Still, nobody is dead. Finally, Gorilla in the front will eat that damage. Gorilla able to clean right up. Right away, they kite back effectively on the side of Afrika. And even though it looks weird to see Malazahar use that ultimate onto Alistar, it's really the most viable target to do so. And then on onto Kuz. Not sure if he still has that QSS, and Tucson in the front too. There's the lockdown out to Alistair. So many shields, but he doesn't look like he can survive. Okay, he's going to try to re-engage there. Big redemption, but down goes Saiyan. That's a lot of damage out of this fight. And still on the chase here is Khan. Marin trying to go 1v5, but look at that damage it's out of Mordekaiser! It's happening again! <laughs> It's happening again, and Mordekaiser and the Kha'Zix on the chase. 
Can they get this kill? There's the QSS trying to go in. The piercing arrow. And down goes Spirit. The ace against no. the Baron. Three to again. <laughs> Instantly. Why would you do this? They engaged. And that's going to be Long to taking game number one. This was not supposed to oh, happen. Oh, God. This is against the script. 46 minutes in. They, they won with a gold deficit. Yeah. 500 gold down. 500. Longju win the game. BDD doesn't look all too happy.